Goedemorgen Nederland. Um, ik ga vandaag even een nieuw filmpje maken, een speciaal filmpje. Een um, filmpje die gaat zal gaan over mijn stagebedrijf. Um, nou, zoals misschien de meeste van jullie al weten, ik loop stage bij Dennis Moss Partnership. En uh, ik heb mijn vriendelijke collega Alexander gevraagd om een korte rondleiding te geven in het bedrijf. Um, het zal wel in het Engels zijn, dus ik hoop dat jullie goed zijn in het Engels. Succes! Welcome Nederland. My name is Alexander Rieder. I'm a town and regional planner. Um, I'm working at the Nesmus Partnership with Niels as his intention. It's a well-known company, Nesmus, in South Africa and also internationally, also South Af in South Africa. We are also situated in the historic core of Salamosh. Um, it's been established in 1985. We probably have about 30 people working here. That's from a cleaning lady to about Dennis Moss himself, who is a managing director of a firm. This is sort of as we, as we stand here outside in this sunny, beautiful spring day. The back garden here, it's sort of it's an old house. It's been built here in 1890. This, the garden was still sort of part of an agricultural land. And some of the trees there, they're about close to 80 years old. Um, old fruit trees, and they're also part of the heritage. The building itself, we're okay, in the back now of the building. Parts of it is still from about 1890. And the latest addition here, on your right hand side, that's been built in 2003, 2004. But everything is still in the architectural historical guidelines. What I'm going to do now today is we're just going to walk through the entire firm. Um, and then I'll show you sort of a different places and the different integrating disciplines that we have here. That makes Dennis Moss partnership quite unique in South Africa. We're probably one of the few firms where we have where we integrate five different or six different disciplines: urban planning, urban design, environmental planning, architecture, landscape architecture, and also multimedia. They're also integrated. This also means that sort of our hardware and our software that we use are state-of-the-art stuff. Uh, we've got a full range of various different softwares, also, in cost, also part of different sort of um, hardware that we use. That's why we can work with projects that are sort of very small, literally on an earth basis, on a house basis, but also to develop it that goes to more than 2,000 houses. So let's move now, Niels, and I'll show you the, the company. This obviously is the parking lot, it's quite obvious. Um, <laughs> We're going to move now to sort of the courtyard area, which we sometimes use for entertainment areas. We normally have a braai or a barbecue, as you will call it. Um, we haven't had one for quite a long time, so it's very necessary. We must have one. Niels must still have a good barbecue. <laughs> this is sort of, it's, it's, it's a nice courtyard. It's private. And it's also typical of an old building that you find quite a lot in Um a Private sort of enclosure. Um, many of our, as I said, I mean we are part of the historic core of Salamosh. Just around the corner we have Dorp Street, which is one of the oldest streets in South Africa. Salamosh, in fact, is the second oldest established settlement in South Africa. And yeah, so it's quite a nice environment from an architectural viewpoint and also sort of from a from a working viewpoint that you actually work in an old old sort of area of Salamosh and it's still here. It's fantastic. So now we go to the courtyard. Um, as quickly we sort of got two conference rooms. There's a courtyard, there's our braai, which haven't been utilized for a while. And we, we, we even have a small little kitchenette or kitchen. That's sort of where people can have a lunch or we can sort of prepare something. Here's one of our very well-known and trusted people working here in Dennis Moss, Maggie. Here's another one, Sophia. They sort of keep the space clean. They give us good coffee. And they are just all around very good people to have around here in Dennis Moss Partnership. Now let's go around here. Here we have sort of a part of a, sort of one of our printers. Here's Michael. He's also been sort of basically since the start of um, Dennis Moss Partnership. 
administrative person and also our trusted driver. Without Michael, we, could, we couldn't have done many things around here. All on time. So now we go. He's one of our sort of well-established sort of um, town regional planners. We need also about 14 years, uh, 13, 14 years, uh, 13 years. Um, this is my office, and also Niels's office. This is where Niels sits for the last couple of, couple of weeks. What I do, I do mostly research of a company. That's why we get all the books here when we start with a, with a, with a project. I normally do the background information and also sort of, we also, uh, most of the stuff here is also got to do with legislation. Um, how we sort of, how do we start a project? Where do you start a project? What, are, what is the environmental implications? What are the planning uh, implications before you start a project? And then sort of we go to the various stages, architecture, landscape architecture, and eventually final design. And we also have multimedia for marketing material. Um, I do sort of volumetric studies, um, for instance like here behind Niels's computer we have a, that's what multimedia does, this is a project in Namibia. Um, as you can see sort of it's a very detailed, informal, but yet sort of a, a good indication about rendered master plans, which we also give as part of a marketing material, but also part of an application process. If we go further to a project. Now we go to the multimedia. Here we are with the multimedia department. We have Bruce here. We have, and as you can see sort of um, what Bruce has been doing with other two colleagues. Do you mind saying something about, about your Yes, okay, this is the um, media department. We do the architectural visualization. We're primarily on uh, SketchUp for 3D modeling. And then for our rendering, we use Atlantis and more recently Lumion for animations. Thank you, Bruce. Now we go to the other two sort of um, people part of the multimedia. Here's Scott, this is Bettina. And um, personal assistant. And here we have Dennis Moss himself in his office. And let's go and see Michelle Moss. She's also responsible for administration, also financial duties. As you can see, we don't only work on computers. She's also one of our, we still use a drawing board for our architectural draftsmen and also for our architects for our projects. Here are some of the projects that she's involved in. Um, as you can see, some of it, this is for instance what multimedia does for the office for a project. This as well, this is for instance the Anin sort of design level. This is also the Jamai project in Namibia. And here we also have a couple of projects going on. This is, I think this is um, at the Orange River, it was Desert Star. It was a movie center. Movie. 
Mega Fern, this is also part of our interior decorating, interior designers sort of um, interior decorating uh, examples. Different types, different carpets down there, different um, towels that you can use. And here we go further. This is Janine, our interior decorator at Dennis Moss Partnership. So as you can see, sort of going back here, as I said before, from the hardware and the software to use, we got very good plotters and printers. Very expensive, but we need that. For to have proper, good sort of plans and presentations. Also, we got a state of art server for our computer systems. We need that because I mean, we've got a lot of international projects, we've got a lot of projects in South Africa. We various probably between it's between 60 to, to 100 projects, different um, stages of projects that we do every month. Uh, at the moment we have less, but um, I know on the books we probably have about, about 150 projects at the moment, currently from very small to very large. Now we go to another section, this is sort of one of our architectural studios. Sort of Ian Lucian Robert, architectural technicians, uh, very important for our firm, technical drawings. You can't issue anything without sort of the technical issues, technical drawings that need to be sort of in, in proper order. Um, because I mean the design has to be technical viable. And that's what they do here. Um, we go sort of further on another couple of offices. Here's Jakob, for instance, architect, director. And these are all empty, all directors' offices. This is, this is another project that we've been involved in. This is Nooit Gedacht. It's a development outside Sanambash. Quite a large um, urban residential project, but it's mixed used. So there's also, um, we have blocks, block of flats, apartments, residential houses, and also sort of small um, shopping centers as well. And this is the scale we're working on, um, probably about all in all, about 200 houses. And um, it's been approved and it's currently in the building phase at the moment in Sanabosch. Now, now we go to another sort of architectural studio. You'll find always sort of, there's a lot of books that we have here. Um, it's all part of our research, all part of our sort of keep abreast with the latest. Um, we also have a policy that we need to be more green, more ecologically and also environmentally, environmentally sensitive. Uh, we also comply to the green guidelines of South Africa, we're also a member of it. So all our developments, houses must be sort of more green, uh, which is a good thing obviously, because we promote sustainable development in the workplace and also sort of with our, um, our projects that we sort of build and design. So now we go to another section here. This is our another architectural studio. Here's Shireen. There's our manual. This is one of our projects that he's been working on in the Seychelles, Seychelles Islands. And um, do you, do you want to say something about it? Or just want to say hello? Hello, <laughs> hello. As I said, this is Amanda, she's our landscape architect at the moment. So as I said, that's one of, the, one of the disciplines that we also promote here and integrate in our development is landscape architecture. And here we go further. Sean. Of 
partnership has been in, in business for about um, 50, 50 years. And we go inside. Yeah, wait, wait, wait. I think it's sleeping. It's my Okay. Yes. Good day, my name is Alexander Rueda. I've been working at Dennis' partnership for about 30 years. <laughs> Welcome, Netherlands. My name is Alexander Rueda. Yes. They screwed all up. I work here. I deal with the family. Let's begin with the introduction. I'm going to see what. You're not working. You're not working. It's a bit off.